Greetings, fellow time travelers. Welcome back to Secrets of the Ancients, where we uncover the hidden mysteries of lost civilizations and dive deep into the secrets that shaped our world. I'm your archaeological guide, ready to take you on another mind-bending journey through the corridors of time. Today's discovery will send chills down your spine, but not for the reasons you might think. We're about to unravel the incredible truth behind one of ancient Egypt's most misunderstood legacies, the eternal guardians we call mummies. Before we unveil these spine-tingling secrets, make sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell. Trust me, you don't want to miss the ancient mysteries we're about to reveal. Picture this haunting scene. Deep beneath the scorching Egyptian desert, Archaeologists have just made a discovery that will rewrite everything we know about ancient burial practices. Sixteen severed human hands, carefully arranged in four mysterious pits. But here's the mind-blowing twist. They're all right hands. Not a single left hand in sight. What dark ritual could explain this gruesome discovery? Why would ancient warriors collect only the right hands of their enemies? Today we're diving deep into the shadowy world of ancient Egyptian death customs, and what we'll uncover will challenge everything you thought you knew about mummies and the afterlife. Transport yourself back 4,500 years to the banks of the mighty Nile River. The air is thick with incense and mystery as priests perform sacred rituals that would ensure eternal life. But these aren't the horror movie monsters Hollywood created. These are the most sophisticated preservation techniques the ancient world ever developed. Imagine standing in an ancient Egyptian embalming chamber, the process you're witnessing took a staggering 70 days to complete. Master embalmers, revered as sacred artists, carefully removed organs and dried the body using natron salt. They wrapped each finger individually in linen strips, soaked in precious resins and honey, materials so valuable they were worth their weight in gold. But here's what will absolutely blow your mind. The ancient Egyptians didn't just preserve bodies, they were creating time machines. They believed they were preparing souls for a journey that would last thousands of years through the dangerous underworld. Now let's travel to 1922, when archaeologist Howard Carter made the discovery of the century. When King Tutankhamun's tomb was opened after 3,000 years, what they found inside was like stumbling upon an ancient Egyptian billionaire's penthouse. Picture this incredible scene, three nested coffins, the innermost made of solid gold weighing over 200 pounds. But that's just the beginning. The tomb contained 36 jars of vintage wine, baskets of fruit preserved for millennia, and enough luxury items to furnish a pharaoh's palace in the afterlife. The young king who ruled over 3,000 years ago was buried with walking sticks made of precious woods, three golden chariots, and enough jewelry to make a modern celebrity jealous. Scientists studying his mummy discovered he suffered from malaria and had a damaged foot that may have caused him to limp, proving that even god kings weren't immune to earthly ailments. But here's where our story takes an incredible turn. Recent archaeological breakthroughs have revealed secrets that would make the ancient embalmers gasp in amazement. Just recently, Egyptian and British archaeologists announced the discovery that has every Egyptologist around the world talking the tomb of King Thutmose II, the last missing royal burial site from Egypt's legendary 18th dynasty. This is the first royal tomb discovered since King Tut's burial chamber over 100 years ago. But the mystery deepens. When archaeologists finally crawled through a 32-foot passageway, a nightmare for anyone with claustrophobia, they discovered something shocking. The tomb was completely empty, not because of tomb robbers, but because ancient floods had forced priests to secretly relocate the pharaoh's mummy to safety. Here's a discovery that will change how you imagine ancient Egyptians forever. Archaeologists have uncovered incredibly detailed mummy portraits, paintings made while people were still alive. These aren't the stylized art we're used to seeing. These are photorealistic portraits painted on wood that show us exactly what ancient Egyptians looked like 4,000 years ago. Scientists are now using these portraits to diagnose diseases by comparing them to the actual mummies. It's like having ancient Egyptian medical records written in paint. But Egypt doesn't hold a monopoly on mummy mysteries. The secrets of preservation spread across continents and cultures in ways that will astound you. Here's something that will surprise you. The ancient Egyptians weren't the first to create mummies. 
2,000 years before the first Egyptian mummy was wrapped, the Chinchoro people of South America were already preserving their dead with techniques so advanced that their mummies are still perfectly preserved today. Sometimes nature creates mummies without any human intervention. Meet Utsi the Iceman, a man who lived 5,000 years ago in Europe and was naturally mummified in alpine ice. When Austrian authorities discovered him in 1991, they initially thought he was a modern mountaineer because his preservation was so perfect. Now, fellow explorers, let's uncover one of history's greatest engineering mysteries. How did ancient Egyptians build structures so precise that modern engineers are still studying their techniques? The Great Pyramid of Giza contains 2.3 million stone blocks, each weighing up to 15 tons. But here's the mind-blowing part. Ancient Egyptian engineers used advanced trigonometry to achieve mathematical precision that rivals modern construction. These master builders created a structure so perfectly aligned that it still stands today, 4,500 years later, while many modern buildings crumble after mere decades. The Shining Monument Picture the moment the Great Pyramid was completed. It wasn't the weathered yellow stone we see today. The entire structure was covered in polished white limestone that gleamed like a mirror in the desert sun. The capstone at the peak was covered in sheets of gold, creating a beacon of light visible for miles across the Egyptian landscape. The excitement never stops in Egyptian archaeology. Recent excavations have revealed discoveries that are rewriting textbooks around the world. American archaeologists are currently excavating a cemetery that may contain over one million mummified bodies. But these aren't royal mummies, they're common people who lived 1500 years ago when Egypt was part of the Roman and Byzantine empires. This massive burial ground called the Way of the Water Buffalo is giving us unprecedented insight into how ordinary ancient Egyptians lived and died. In the Valley of the Monkeys, archaeologists discovered hundreds of mummified baboons, but the story behind these sacred animals is heartbreaking. Scientists determined these baboons, considered sacred to Thoth, the god of wisdom, were kept indoors and suffered from severe vitamin deficiencies. It shows us that even ancient religious practices had their dark sides. One of the most bizarre recent discoveries involves mummies fitted with golden tongues. Ancient Egyptians believed these precious metal implants would allow the deceased to speak in the afterlife. Imagine trying to explain that to your modern dentist. Phase 8, Engineering Marvels Beyond Egypt, but let's expand our archaeological horizons. Ancient civilizations worldwide created monuments that rival Egypt's greatest achievements. Travel with me to County Meath, Ireland, where Newgrange stands as proof that advanced engineering wasn't limited to Egypt. Built around 3,200 years before Christ, this stone monument is older than both Stonehenge and the Great Pyramid. Its builders used over 220,000 tons of stone and created a structure so water-resistant it has survived 5,000 years of Irish weather. From the Glass Pyramid at the Louvre Museum in Paris, to the 48-story Transamerica Pyramid in San Francisco, modern architects still draw inspiration from ancient Egyptian design. But Las Vegas went all out. The Luxor Hotel is the third-largest pyramid on Earth, complete with a Sphinx replica that stands 110 feet tall taller than the original in Giza. Phase 9. The Ultimate Ancient Mystery. Here's where our journey takes its most intriguing turn. Recent research suggests that the Steppe Pyramid of Djoser, Egypt's oldest pyramid, may have incorporated the world's first hydraulic elevator system. Picture this incredible engineering feat. Ancient Egyptian builders may have used a massive water-powered lift system to raise the heavy stone blocks like a giant hydraulic jack powered by floodwater from the Nile, this theoretical system could have revolutionized pyramid construction 4,700 years ago. While scientists debate whether this hydraulic system actually existed, the possibility shows us that ancient Egyptian engineers were far more advanced than we ever imagined. They weren't just building tombs, they were creating technological marvels that pushed the boundaries of human achievement. Fellow time travelers, what we've discovered today proves that ancient civilizations possessed knowledge and skills that continue to amaze us thousands of years later. From the sophisticated mummification techniques that preserved bodies for millennia, to the mathematical precision that created monuments still standing today, our ancestors were true masters of science and engineering. But here's the question that keeps archaeologists awake at night. 
What other secrets are still buried beneath the sands of time? What revolutionary discoveries await us in unexplored tombs and forgotten cities? Share your theories with us in the comments below. Which ancient mystery fascinates you most? Do you think the hydraulic pyramid theory could be true? And don't forget to subscribe for more incredible archaeological adventures. In our next episode, we'll travel to the mysterious civilization of the Maya, where we'll uncover the secrets of their incredible astronomical knowledge and the truth behind their supposedly lost cities. Trust me, what we'll discover will challenge everything